we've got another one of our very special guests with some extremely cool news. Uh, I'm just going to bring him up right now. Come on up. This is Mr. Jim Campbell, and he is the Vice President of Performance Vehicles and Motorsports for General Motors. Such a cool title. Welcome to the reveal. You've got some stuff to tell these people. Ladies and gentlemen, it's quiet. This is the E-Copo concept. It's an all-electric drag racing concept that Chevrolet brought to SEMA. Fully electrified Copo, and I want to introduce the build team that built this. And from Hancock and Lane Racing, Jeff Lane, who is right, uh, here's Jeff. Good to see you, Jeff. Thank you for everything you did. This guy has, uh, knows how to win on the track. He's the winningest driver in NHRA Division Six in the south, uh, southwest of the country, or northwest of the country. Thanks for being here. Thanks for what you did in the build. Cody Lane's here. He races in stock and super stock, and he's part of the build team. And then behind the wheel, come on out. This is Patrick McHugh. Now, Patrick McHugh, welcome, Patrick. Good to see you, buddy. Let's give him a round of applause. Here. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Grab a, grab a stand right over there. I want to tell you about Patrick teacher in the Seattle area at Bothell High School and he teaches an auto tech program to about 60 students a year they meet every day for two to three hours and work on automotive tech and he's a pioneer in electric drag racing right here and what he does he uses electric drag race as a way to get the kids excited about STEM science technology engineering and math and alternative propulsion systems so I want to thank these three guys along with Russell Blanis from Chevrolet Roger McCormick and so many people in the audience that helped put this together. Great job, guys. So proud of you. Give them a round of applause. Awesome job. So let's talk about what is under the hood. What is under the hood? There's two Board Warner electric motors that are set up in series, a single assembly, plus we have two inverters. This is a bolt-in replacement for the V8. It fits right in the LS bell housing that mounts directly to the transmission, which is a turbo 400 three-speed auto. And so, what about the battery? This is exciting. We have four 200-volt mod uh, modules, four 200-volt modules, two in the back seat, two in the trunk for 800 volts. First application for Chevrolet ever at 800 volts. It's very exciting. Well, what about the power? Over 700 horsepower is generated from this combination and 600 foot-pounds of, listen to this, instantaneous torque. That is very exciting. How does it perform, guys? I know you were out at the uh, at Las Vegas Motor Speedway, and uh, the predicted ETs, and we're in the early days of testing, in the high nines, traps in the high 130s, low 140s, and with this battery pack, you can get three to four runs, plus we have a per charge, plus we have a 25-minute top-off charge, which is excellent when you're trying to go between rounds, back to back. Thanks so much, and we'll see you at the display tomorrow. Hey, thank you, Jim. How about that, an electric Camaro? You didn't think you would uh, see that anytime soon. And not just an electric Camaro, but one that is designed to be racing, which I love.